हेलो स्टूडेंट्स टूडेज टॉपिक इज इक्लिब्रम इनकम इनकम डिटर्मिनेशन वेन द गवर्नमेंट इज इंक्लूडेड वाई इक्वल्स टू ए डी इन द नेक्स्ट स्टेप वी विल राइट वाई इक्वल्स टू ऑटोनॉमस स्पेंडिंग प्लस एम पी सी टाइम्स इनकम यू शुड नोट दैट दिस टर्म रिप्रेजेंट्स एम पी सी आउट ऑफ डिस्पोजेबल इनकम हाउ एवर दिस होल टर्म रिप्रेजेंट्स एम पी सी आउट ऑफ इनकम आफ्टर सॉल्विंग वी विल गेट इक्लिब्रम लेवल ऑफ आउटपुट एज ए बार अपॉन वन माइनस एम पी सी एम पी सी आउट ऑफ इनकम नेक्स्ट टॉपिक इज इनकम टैक्सेस एंड द मल्टीप्लायर इनकम टैक्सेस रिड्यूस द मल्टीप्लायर बिकॉज दे रिड्यूस द इंड्यूस्ड इंक्रीज ऑफ कंजम्पन आउट ऑफ चेंजेस इन इनकम द इंक्लूजन ऑफ टैक्सेस फ्लैटन्स द एग्रीगेट डिमांड कर्व एंड हैंस रिड्यूस द मल्टीप्लायर नेक्स्ट वन इनकम टैक्सेस एज ऑटोमेटिक स्टेबलाइजर्स ऑटोमेटिक स्टेबलाइजर An automatic stabilizer is any mechanism in the economy that automatically, that is, without case by case government intervention, reduces the amount by which output changes in response to a change in autonomous demand. We know that when the autonomous demand changes, it leads to change in output, but automatic stabilizer reduces the impact of change in autonomous demand. on the change in output without case by case government intervention examples first example is proportional income tax swings in investment demand have a smaller effect on output when automatic stabilizer such as proportional income tax are in place this means that in the presence of automatic stabilizers we should expect output to fluctuate less than it would without them let's see how suppose that autonomous investment decreases by rupees 20 crore it will lead to decrease in autonomous spending by rupees 20 crore now we have two situations first one autonomous taxes in which the taxes have been given as rupees 5 crore and the other one is proportional taxes in which the taxes have been given as a proportion of income 0.2y or 20% of y where 20% is our tax rate suppose that mpc out of income in case of autonomous taxes is 0.5 then mpc out of income in case of proportional taxes will be 0.4 i am showing here the calculation part that is mpc out of income in case of proportional taxes 0.5 this is mpc out of disposable income 1 minus tax rate tax rate is 0.2 Zero point five multiplied by zero point eight, and this is zero point four. So this is MPC out of income in case of proportional taxes. The value of multiplier in case of autonomous taxes is two, and the value of multiplier in case of proportional taxes is one point six. so you can see that the value of multiplier in case of proportional taxes is less change in income in case of autonomous taxes is rupees 40 crore and the change in income in case of proportional taxes is rupees 32 crore so at last the conclusion is that the change in income in case of proportional taxes is 
less as compared to the change in income of autonomous taxes. So proportional taxes act as an automatic stabilizer which reduces the impact of change in autonomous spending on change in output. Second example, unemployment benefits. Unemployment benefits enable the unemployed to continue consuming even though they do not have a job. So transfer payment rises when output falls. This means that demand falls less when someone becomes unemployed and receives benefits than it would if there were no benefits. This too makes the multiplier smaller and output more stable. Thank you.